Well, hello. So today, I want to say thank you to Tina Fey and everybody involved with The Unbreakable Kenny Schmidt on Netflix. Season 2, I just finished watching it. Very, there's, there's gemstones of shows that are able to uh, take comedy, take drama, take acting, take it all, and, and present a beautiful, beautiful picture beautiful element uh and the jokes where you just knock them out of the park where they're multi-layered simpsons level quality kind of entertainment that you that us the fans would hope would go for like at least 10 20 seasons you know we hope uh because we we love the writing we love the characters we just fall in love with everything that that is being put together uh the world fell in love with 30 rock of course we fell in love with 30 bullet rock the Unbreakable Kimmy Schmidt, I believe, personally, is a whole level higher. It's a whole level higher. I think it's an evolved version of whatever it is Tina Fey was trying to present. It's beautiful. It's absolutely beautiful. Um, having Tina Fey on it, addressing the issue of addiction, addressing the issue of parenting, you know, and relationships within parents and that whole element. And uh, triggers and elements with triggers and uh, psychological triggers and, and trauma and that whole element. So, um, and what it means, if you don't know the premise of the story, uh, Ellie Kemper plays Kimmy Schmidt, uh, who was kept in a bunker for 15 years with three other women in a cult. <laughs> and so she comes out, she lives in New York, she has a group of friends, and she is trying to make sense out of life. It's hilarious. It's absolutely, I mean, joke. Literally, I get ab pains out of how much laughter there is in the show. It's, they, they're knock every single line, they're just knocking it out of the park. Super highly recommended. Um, if you haven't seen it, it's, it's a must, must see on Netflix. So thank you, Tina Fey. Thank you, Ellie Kemper. Thank you, everybody involved with uh, Unbreakable Kimmy Schmidt. Uh, so excited for season three. We'll see, you know, what, what's going to happen. I'm not going to give any spoilers away, but will there be a divorce? I hope so. And how will that happen? Uh, so thank you for listening, and I wish you a wonderful year. Take care.